families. Let's just pray for America. Let's just pray for our nation. Come on, just pray. Just pray for revival. Come on, just pray for revival. Pray for faith. 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 Boldness. Courage. Strength. Katura, and uh, she is a 10-year-old revivalist. She's a prophesying machine. She finds anybody on the streets anywhere, and she prophesies. She brings hope. And my family's been on this journey. I have four kids, and we've taken them all across America. And my kids have, they're going to look back at 2020, and they're not going to remember the pandemic as much as they're going to remember revival. And so I want Katura to pray. Uh, she was doing this at the White House a couple days ago, just praying for people. I want her to pray for an awakening in her generation. I believe with all my heart, God wants to capture this generation, not with video games, but with this presence. So Tura, come on, just pray over them. Dear Jesus, I just pray for my generation to be more in love with you, to know more of you, to experience more, because God, you're so good. You're so good. And I know that things are gonna be different, so different. I pray for the cross to make a way. I pray for a revival to hit. And I just saw everyone just opening a gift from God. I feel like everybody is gonna get a beautiful gift from the Holy Spirit. <sighs> yes. I just pray for more of that. I'm just gonna, yeah, I just blast that over everyone. I just feel everyone's glowing. Everyone's glowing in your presence. I pray for more of that, because you're so good. Come on. You're amazing. <laughs> yeah, Tara. So Lord, we say awaken the hearts of the young generation. Captivate, captivate the next generation with your glory. 